Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles the movie was a great film. Pretty much everything about the movie was awesome. The animation, the writing, the music. So it was no surprise to see that the Rise movie was nominated for a Best Character Design Award. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my Ninja Turtles channel for more Ninja Turtles videos like this. The Rise Turtles movie was excellent. It had wonderful animation and voice acting and action. One part of the success of the movie is character design. The way the characters look. Who created the look of these characters for the movie? The turtles and their allies and enemies all have a lot of personality and part of that charm comes from the way they look. I was very happy to see that Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles the movie was nominated for an Annie Award. The Annie Awards claim to be animation's highest honor, where they recognize and honor all the stars of the art form of animation. The other nominees include Luck, Puss in Boots, The Last Wish, The Bad Guys, and Wendell and Wild. The Rise Turtles movie is in great company, and I'm sure it's a thrill for the Turtles team to be complimented on their work. The Annie Awards credit the Rise movie to Nickelodeon Animation Studio and Ida Hem for best character design. I checked out Ida Hem's website and Instagram, and she's obviously pretty talented. She shares behind-the-scenes sketches and drawings of characters from the Turtles show and movie. It's great to see alternate takes and early drawings that led up to the Rise movie. It's really fascinating to see how these preliminary drawings translate into the final product. A lot of the angles and emotion are already present in these early character design sketches from Ida Hem. I love behind-the-scenes info and I really enjoy seeing how movies are made, and Ida Hem's Instagram is a jackpot for Turtles content. It looks like Bryce Collins and Dan Holland are credited with character design as well in the end credits of the movie. This team did really great stuff with this film. Every frame of the movie and show was stuffed with beautiful visuals. The color, the movement, and all the people, props, environments, and creatures are terrific. And this nomination for Best Character Design isn't the Rise movie's only nomination for an award. The Rise of the TMNT movie is also up for an award for Outstanding Achievement in Sound Editing. The movie is part of the 2023 Golden Reel Awards Sound Editorial nominees. The movie was full of amazing sounds. The music, the sound effects, and voice acting were all top-notch. The Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie even won an award for Best Ninja Turtles Movie of the Year here on my Ninja Turtles channel at the 2020 TMNT Awards show. I'm sure hundreds of people worked on the Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie, and I feel each and every one of them deserve an award for their contributions. The Rise of the TMNT movie was bold and dramatic and exciting, and many Turtles fans feel that the movie was the best part of the entire Rise series. It had the action and emotions cranked all the way up, and this film was a great ride. The Rise movie stands on its own as well. People saw this movie without seeing the series and really enjoyed it. And people who saw every episode of Rise watched this movie and it made them love the whole Rise of the TMNT series even more. On behalf of all Rise fans and all Ninja Turtles fans, I'd like to thank the Rise team for making such a great series and such a great movie. They deserve every award that they've been nominated for. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a comment and share this video. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more Ninja Turtles videos like this.